Can we at least turn the air on? No. No. You know, hey, stop. You know the rules. Can we at least roll a window down? No, nope, you can't roll the window down, Brandon. Mm -mm. I know how to break her. I just be in there cutting the cheese. <laughs> Nah, stop. <laughs> I'd be bringing up her socks. <laughs> uh, you gonna roll the window down, girl. Yeah, you gonna roll the window down today. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Welcome back. I'm Simon Toastkin. This is Buff Pro. Today, we're going back to one of our favorite shows in existence on TLC Extreme Cheapskates. This one's called Woman Collects Strangers' Odd Socks to Use Instead of Sanitary Pads. And the very first thing we see here is the rusty nail. The rusty nail. <laughs> this is gonna be a this is gonna uh, be a good one right here. I feel I feel it coming. All right, before we get in, go ahead and take a guess by how much money she saves per year doing this. With least cheap take at least four hundred million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say two hundred and eighty-two thousand. Oh guaranteed. man, two, ooh, I got. One dollar. Is the price is right? Does anybody get that? <laughs> yeah. Come on down. Come on down. Does anybody watch that anymore? Does anybody watch the price? Does anybody is stay home? Even, is that a show anymore? He used to get sick and stay home and the price is right was literally the only thing on TV aside from soap operas. Yeah. I always wish I could come on down. I would have guessed them prices better than those people. <laughs> anyway, save some money. <laughs> Let's get some tips on how to save money right now. <laughs> Go look at it. Is it Scott? <laughs> <laughs> Scott! Where you been? Where the building logs been? Try to save them. I'm always looking for a way to. Oh, I thought she was about to. I thought. <laughs> Turn them all up. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Saving money. Goldilocks. I hate spending money on anything I don't have to. Her name is Goldilocks. Nice. You think that's her legal name? Nice. Yeah. You gotta get okay. the rusty nails hers. She she bartended. She's doing everything, trying to save some money. She sings, she does it all. <laughs> Goldilocks is the one-stop shop. Wow. Can I grab two empty shot glasses from you? Thank you. She about to serve that to somebody? Goldilocks, you're going to jail! <laughs> you're going to jail! <laughs> I can't believe this! I trusted you! <laughs> Bro, I can't even- I don't even want to think about like how dirty that thing is right there. Oh, look at it! <laughs> <laughs> no! You think they actually ever watched that thing? Probably not. Ah. Because that costs money for soap. <laughs> Oh, oh man, she's like, oh, some leftover beer here. Don't worry, I got you guys. We're about to get drunk oh after that show. Oh my gosh. She's, she's, oh, this couldn't have been 2020. <laughs> <laughs> she's the reason, though. Shot, <laughs> shot. Here's your beer. beer. I mean, she's even like looking at him, too, like. She's like, yeah, you like that? <laughs> How about that, boys? Yeah, he's looking back and forth. Oh, you like that? These are Ben members. Like, <laughs> she's trying to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> this dude in the top hat here, he's got his top hat, sunglasses on inside, and a kilt. And a kilt? He's got a kilt on as well. This guy is... Oh, man, he's doing it. And he's got a front pocket? He is all the way that guy. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen some people kind of be that guy a little bit, but this guy's all he's the way. He's all the way that he's, guy. Yeah, 100% yeah. in. When we're done with the show, I get paid. And then I disperse it to my bandmates. Good show, got your money. Shoo, time to get paid. Everyone's excited, you know? He's like, heck yeah. Oh, who's the dude with the curly hair? Was yeah, who, who, what was he? I don't know, maybe the drummer or something? I don't know, I wasn't really paying attention. Yeah. She didn't buy him a shot. Yeah. He What's up with that? Or maybe he knows better. <laughs> <laughs> He's over there like, I'm, I'm good, guys. I, <laughs> no, go, you, you go ahead. <laughs> Last week when I was running you around, it's twelve dollars and eleven cents. I always make sure that I deduct whatever monies are owed to me. Goldie's ruthless. Jeez. She keeps track of, of every penny. Scrooge McDuck over oh here. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Here's your money, guys, for the week. Uh, and by the way, I also owe me for this. I feel, <laughs> I feel like I've seen like a comedy movie about this. It's like this, this, this. Just the two dollars left in his hand. <sighs> 
Yeah, go Goldie, man. She just keeps up with everything. We don't, so we don't really actually know what we owe her. Apparently, <laughs> mileage is expensive. Yeah. <laughs> she drove me around ten dollars worth of gas. <laughs> I drive my bandmates around a lot. Sometimes it's not for band duties. Sometimes it's just they need a ride. I think it's only fair that I charge them fifty six cents a mile. Fifty six cents a mile? Where'd she get that? I don't know. Uh, you can only deduct like 25 cents a mile. I mean, like well, any job I've ever worked that's mileage, like 25 cents a mile at most. Right. You know? Dang. The gas must be real expensive where they live. You know? <laughs> and she gets like five miles to the gallon. <laughs> oh, oh, do you need to ride home too? I got, I got you. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah, yeah that, sounds, that sounds great. <laughs> I think it's only fair that I charge. Run. Don't, don't have her drive you. Run. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Goldie estimates she saves an average of $725 a month. She also keeps a close tab on all of her personal costs. Is that the truck she drives around in? Oh, no, that's probably why it costs so much, because yeah. that thing is old and... <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> probably getting like 12 miles a gallon. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 10. Goldie estimates she saves an average of $725 a month. How did she save $720? By doing what? By just keeping up with things? <laughs> what that by mean? charging her bandmates? Yeah. By... I I really don't know. Yeah, she just she just makes $700 a month somehow. By going to the laundromat, <laughs> <laughs> she robs people of $725 a month. There's always mismatched socks left behind. Women spend two or $300 easily a year on feminine products. Easily. That's a scam. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Some dude, uh, whose sock is this? Don't know. Bro. Don't know. Not but I trust him. Oh Kirby here. <laughs> oh Kirby and his mustache. He's got the mother load. Look at these socks I found, girl. Ooh, dang. I just keep them aside for old Cody. Yeah. I'll ask what she does with them, but man, she loves her some socks. Yeah. yeah. She don't look like she pays for them. Yeah, does she pay for them? Probably not. <laughs> Probably just gives them to her. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh. I've been known to use them for sanitary napkins. Was that a Nisa? She's <laughs> got that. Must have that heavy flow because that was a big sock. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. She could wrap that one all the way around. You know what I'm saying? I'd be like. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that sock to come out there. I was thinking like a little ankle sock or something. Right, so I was just like, right. Woo, good uh, lord. I've been known to use them for sanitary napkins. She even like looks away. She doesn't even look yeah, it's like sanitary napkins. Even <laughs> even she's disgusted with herself right now. Uh, got some stories about some socks. I don't know if that's what you want to be doing. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Am I dead? <laughs> then I was pregnant. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I got this real stiff sock one day. <laughs> Why is this one still soggy? I don't understand. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> she like comes out like she's like sneaking around. Well, the first thing I thought about though is like like the bulge. She put some jeans on, everybody's like, Hey, Goldie, <laughs> what's up? Oh. Uh, you happy to see me? You got like a bunch of socks in your pants. <laughs> People laugh. My way is way more cost effective. And it's environmentally friendly. It's cost effective because she gets the sock for free and then she uses it and just throws it away. And it's environmental friendly because just throwing away your used socks is good for the environment, I guess. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Nice. <laughs> I mean, aside from it being just gross, like none of that made any sense at all, Goldie. We're not <sighs> laughing at you because I mean, we're laughing at you for several reasons, <laughs> <laughs> but mainly because what you said is just kind of dumb. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna just put those in there, and that I guess it's not gonna hurt. I don't really mind. She's really sweet, but it's just a little ghetto. It's a little weird. You know, I love you. Hey, uh, I see you got a little extra room in there. You mind if I throw my jeans in there? And I got these socks, right? Like, 
imagine if Goldie did this to Goldie, she'd over be charging like you know fifty six cents a load. Like, well, yeah, you owe me uh, her article of clothing. Right, right. Uh, you think she like hangs around too and only shows up when like this girl's there? You're oh. the only one that let me wash my clothes. <laughs> so uh, hey, <laughs> we go. Come uh, on. She's always texting. You know, like hey, did you say you were swinging by the laundromat today? <laughs> I'll see you there cool. on my way. <laughs> I have a washer and dryer, but it's going to cost three to five dollars in water and power to do the amount of laundry that I need to do. So why would I do that? Yeah, why would you do that? I mean, according to why her would I use my washer and dryer that I own and instead drive that big tank to the laundromat? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Fifty-six cents a mile. You know, that's the the, the standard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's. Uh, <sighs> We've watched a lot of extreme cheapskate shows, and there's one thing that we know for sure is that the people on these shows don't actually math any of this out. They just say, <laughs> oh, yeah, I can just, I'm saving money. Yeah, somehow, somewhere. I use socks as sanitary I pads. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, how do you even go to the laundromat and do your laundry for less than 3 to $5? I don't understand. <laughs> That's a lot of quarters, you know. Back when I was a starving artist and when I was trying to break in, it was an absolute necessity to save every possible penny that you could. Okay. Oh, so she, she, she learned on the road when she was a starving artist. That's right. Yeah, she would be a starving artist still, but now she's learned how to exploit her friends for gas. <laughs> <laughs> and everything's okay. That's right. Actually, I don't know. I don't know anything about their band or anything. The Goldilocks band? Let's, let's see. Let's, 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 yeah. look, let's look up the it? band here. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Oh, look nice. at that. Oh, they replaced their drummer. Oh, yeah, that guy. <laughs> a dr new drummer. Yeah, yeah. The other okay. one got tired of paying for it. Oh, knew everybody. Okay. Yeah, nobody. <laughs> <laughs> None of these people None are the same. None of those people. Yeah, okay. She gave them shots. <laughs> they all disappeared. Anyone here from TLC, <laughs> TLC Cheapskates that want to use the socks as pads? <laughs> <laughs> hey, but PS, this, this band has good music. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you still cheap. <laughs> they liked it. <laughs> Your shadow. So gold. Okay. Oh, we're on the Wikipedia now, and her birth name was Moon Shadow. She also has a professional wrestling career. Oh man! All right. <laughs> I think we should be pro wrestlers. By the way. Yeah. 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 We can make it. We can do it. Yeah. What would be your What would be your gimmick? Me? Yeah. I don't even know now. This video really changed things for me. I wanted to get in there and just jack somebody's sock, but now it's like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Her versus mankind. He gets a sock on his oh. sock. Oh, no. <laughs> and she's like trying to take it the whole time. Like, give me that. He gets ready to do the move where he like puts a sock in her mouth, but instead she's like, mm -mm. She's like oh no, no. <laughs> and it turns into a whole different kind of show after yeah, that. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> I live in an old hospital that I just renovated myself. I asked my realtor to find me a space nobody else would want. Something she lives in the hospital that she renovated. I mean, that's pretty cool if she renovated this thing i mean like she's got some pretty nice stuff oh, in here i'm looking at yeah. the countertops and things like that oh, i mean she lives in nashville oh god she's gonna come and get us <laughs> oh yeah oh, no. oh listen oh we're not that far what away was, uh, <laughs> this is great great yeah. way to save money very good would recommend 10 out of 10 mm -hmm. very nice love your music mm. and then <laughs> it's definitely not weird mm -mm. there was iv stands cots medical supplies Went ahead and got some curtain rods at a thrift store, three bucks. And this is where I do all my entertaining, have my friends over every piece of... Look at that freaking thing back there. What that is that? statue thing? What is that mirror back there? Oh my God. Oh, that? Yeah, well, the statue too? Yeah. I'm like... <laughs> How much money is she saving? <laughs> She's about to say that everything in here is super cheap. Yeah. Mm. Oh, $3 on these curtains. A <laughs> hundred grand on the statue, <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. This is my retro egg chair that I got at a garage sale for five bucks. If I were to go buy one of these, it would be at least 150 or 200 bucks. I'm pretty sure I saw one of those on Amazon for like 20 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> what was that thing called? Hang on, hang on. Uh, Whoa, these things are like a thousand. Oh, maybe she did save some. Well, these got like pads and stuff in there. Yeah, you know? that one looked like a whole freaking chamber, like a. <laughs> <laughs> Just crawl in that one. 
Well, never mind. We can't find the exact one that she's got, but all the ones, the egg chairs. Why are egg chairs so expensive? Look at that hand. Look at that hand. The hand chair. Oh my gosh. Dude, you could spend $109 to get a purple hand chair. Dude, that's so cool. Nice. It's like Thanos out there, just like, let me, I got you, dog. <laughs> yeah, I got yeah, you. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> oh, man. Well, whatever. Let's try to bust her out, but we can't find the same egg chair, so never mind. Maybe, maybe she's right. Maybe it is expensive. Whatever. You got us. Electricity alone, when people start plugging in all of this stuff, it's been crazy. I'm not having the band practice at my house anymore. So where is this rehearsal space? No, she's driving. Oh she's, no! She's she loaded everybody in the van. She's driving people to somewhere else. They're gonna they're gonna practice, and she's gonna charge them all gas. She's yeah. I was gonna say she's slowly draining them right now. Oh my! Three mm. people, fifty cents a, a mile. Oh boy! Mm mm mm. They gotta unload all that stuff. Practice. Load it all back up. Pay her to drive them. Ouch. Oh boy. Can we at least turn the air on? No. No. Okay. You know, hey, stop. You know the rules. Can we at least roll a window down? No, you can't roll the window down, Brandon. How much electricity? What? How much they paying per mile and they can't even like turn the air conditioner on, roll a window down? Are you are you serious? Mm -mm. I know how to break her. I just be in there cutting the cheese. <laughs> No, nah, stop. I'd be bringing up her socks. <laughs> uh, you gonna roll the window down, girl. Yeah, you gonna roll the window down today. <laughs> I know the band would probably prefer to be cruising down the highway with the windows down and being cool, but that creates drag, and that makes the gas mileage even less. How much drag do you think having your windows down creates? Oh, man. Is this, is, this an air, is this an air conditioner right here? What is that above this? <laughs> what is that? We're going to save 3 to $4 a tank by keeping the windows up. Sweating my butt off. It. Well, you guys can handle it. Can I? I, I can't. She just stopped talking about like how much money she's saving on gas when she's charging these guys as much as she's charging them per mile. I mean, come on. Man, I would. Ugh. I do not like her right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be pretty upset. I don't I don't think I'd be in this band very long. Yeah. Yeah, you can have water. I brought you guys some water. One for everybody. This is it. Come on. We got it. Let's go. Get her done. This is what I'm talking about. I don't even about. think this is considered a cross. This is this is free. Yeah. Just get well, it's gonna practice on the on the street side. The front porch there? <laughs> like, dude, I'll be so mad right now. <laughs> 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 I'd be like, on the way home, we're rolling the windows down. I mean, I'm surprised that she actually had bottled water for them to have in the truck. Like, like, <sighs> saving all this money. You know how much money we could save if we didn't buy bottled water? Oh, that's from her tap. Yeah, that's probably, that's probably right. <laughs> she, she didn't spend time to wash them bottles. You're probably right. I'm going to find any place and every place that I can to practice in for free. Oh, heck no. The fact this place has... Electricity is blowing my mind, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the power's still on. Let's we'll go play in here, right here. I'm just mad. <laughs> I don't care how cheap you are. This this is a, this is like petty cheapness. This is this just is... like the only reason anybody's even watching this video is because you freaking stick socks in your underwear. Nobody cares about <laughs> all the stupid stuff you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, this lady. Let's see, what the, let's see what the comments have to say about her. It's so dope how she flipped the hospital into a livable environment. Yeah, that's pretty cool, actually. Kinda, that was like yeah. that's like the one kind of cool thing that she did. <laughs> but then the next person, not even she's putrid and they didn't show the whole house. Facts. Ah, yeah. that is a big fact. Yeah, they only showed two rooms of the whole place. <laughs> it's environmental friendly. Throw sock in trash rather than washing it and reusing it. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, I screamed, you said, it's a little ghetto. <laughs> oh, yeah, the shot glass. <sighs> yeah, I, she, didn't, I mean, she didn't drink any of that. She gave them that. Just yeah, watched them she drink gave, it. oh my yeah. gosh. <gasps> anyway, let us know what you think of this video in the comments below. I, I give this a big old gross at a, at a, mm, yeah, sad. Yeah, <laughs> a big, a big yeah. gross at a just sad. You know what you need to do? You need to go get yourself some dishwasher lasagna and chill out. That's what you need to do. <laughs> Roll the windows down. Oh, Dang. Oh, man. Oh, I don't know if I told you that we, the, the dishwasher lasagna uh, extreme cheapskate we did, the people in the video that, you know, sold the rights 
to all that stuff to TLC tried to claim the video for, <laughs> for the dishwasher lasagna bit. Really? Their secret recipe, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> they, they hurt nice. so, they hurt so bad they gotta try to clean one of my videos, I guess. <laughs> nice. Oh, we'll see you guys next time. I love you.